Hello to integrators, this is Ms. Dana Tawi. Today we're going to have a quick revision for the material for your exam, final exam. As you know, the uh, um, grammatical structure that are included in the final exam are reported speech, causative, and person and personal. Now I have managed here to make a quick revision for you so that you could be able to uh, understand all of the things that uh, are required from you. First of all, we're going to know <coughs> reported speech. Reported speech it means when we uh, say what other person has said. So when you report what other person has said. Remember that there are three things we need to change. The pronouns, the tense, the adverbs of place and time. Of course, when we talk about reported, we talk about statements, sentences, we talk about questions and we talk about orders. Now, let's have a look at the reporting statements. When I say here, I am happy, then she said that is optional remember i change the pronouns and i change the tense that she am um, you go one step backward she was happy okay okay now look at the second sentence <clears throat> i was happy <clears throat> he said that it's optional i would see it he remember when i when we talk about was when you reported it becomes had been so he had been happy okay i have a book he said he the past of have had a book I had a book. Look at it. I had a book. He said he had had. Because this is verb 2, you need to change it into verb 3. So it becomes had had a book. Have you called your dad? She asked me. This is just no question if I do the shifting here because it's me here if I the past of have is had if I had called your dad see my dad okay now moving to the orders stop talking again Ahona he ordered me again I orders you have to put two and then you continue sentence after two I have always infinitive to stop talking now don't talk he asked or he ordered me because I have here not had to not wanna had to do and has to do not to talk moving to the next sentence I had had a book this is had had this is verb three who were past perfect Remember that when we have past perfect, you don't change anything. So it becomes, becomes here. He said, he had had a book. So the difference between this sentence and this sentence is that had here, it's the main verb. With had here, it's a helping verb. And then we have here the main verb. This is past simple. You need to change it into past perfect. This is past perfect. You don't change it. It remains the same. Now moving to the reporting questions. <clears throat> Where have you been? Remember, I say he asked me, for example. Where? Then you do the shift, okay? Where? I, the past of have, had, been. It's a sentence. Time. What was he doing? She asked what? You do the shifting here. He was Hakana Bitsir had been doing. Okay. Why had you invited Mary? <clears throat> she asked me. Why? I do the shift. I Bitsir, you Bitsir, I don't know. She's asking me why. Had invited, this is verb past perfect, so you don't change it. Why I had invited Mary okay did you call him she asked me remember that this is yes no question so 
I begin with if or whether. If you do the shift here, if I, this is verb two, so it becomes if I had called him. Was he under stress? Type. She asked me. Because this is just no question if he was had been. Remember that, Yashir. I'm giving you the most important uh, sentences. If he had been under stress. Moving to the second grammatical structure that is uh, required from you, Lihul causative. Remember that the causative it means when you arrange for someone to do something for you. So basically, you're not the person who did the action. For example, the mechanic fixes my car. When you want to change it into a causative, I ask the mechanic to fix my car. I have my car fixed. And mind you that when when we talk about causative, had kun here is structured as as the, uh, as um, as I am writing it, subject plus have plus the object plus the past participle. Hai doesn't come out Okay, have and I take it from the tense from the sentence itself. Okay, the painter painted our house. Ta'ma we arrange for the painter to paint our house. Ma'atu hona had sir and we. I look at the verb. Painted is past. So I will tell you, instead of have, I'm going to put it had. We had. What is the uh, object? We had our house and the past participle painted. Okay. The man is collecting my money. So I'm asking the man to collect my money. I is collecting my money. I am having. You don't change the tense, but you use have. I am having what? My Money and the past participle of collect here collected. She has cut my hair. I asked her to cut my hair. I has cut here. This is present perfect. I have I have had my hair cut. Okay. He had sold the car for me. I Asked him to, sold, to, to sell the car. I had sold. This is past perfect. Hanazil I had. With the sriif the third one had. And I need to have the subject plus have plus object plus past participle. Hi, it depends. This have depends on the tense itself. So I had had <coughs> the car sold. Finally, she wrote the email for me. Manato I had wrote verb two. I had the email. The past participle here is written. I had the email written. The last grammatical structure, who are personal and impersonal passive. Now, in order for you to understand, it's really easy. Alain people believe that she was living here. If I ask you for uh, personal, for impersonal, I delete people, it. I look at the verb believe, manato. <coughs> Present simple. Manat had kunat. It is believed. Had kamil bagi al jumla zay mahi. Okay. Lakin. Iza bdiya ha personal. Okay. Had shuf into hana. She is believed. Yani already the people we always delete it. Okay. She is believed. Had had to. Had had wara ha lihiya infinitive base verb. The base verb of was lihiya to be. To be living here. Okay, let's have a look at another, uh, at another sentence. People believe that uh, the sun goes around the uh, earth. I delete it. Personal or impersonal? It. Believe verb to, it was believed. That, and you complete the sentence as it is. Now here, the second one, personal. The sun was believed. At hot to base verb of go goes he go to go around the sun. Okay, people thought that the man was guilty. It and I have told people it was and have thought verb two. It was thought, and you complete the sentence. Okay, type. What if I want personal the other, the other way? Hot honor the man was thought to. The past, uh, the the base verb of was here to be guilty. Okay, 
the last sentence, people think that the man is innocent. It, think, verb one, manatu, it is thought. Sorry. And you complete the sentence as it is. But what if I want the other way around? I take the object here, here, the man is thought to the base form uh, of is here to be innocent. This is the grammatical structures for the final exam. I hope that everything is clear for you. There's also um, a worksheet for the uh, for revision. If you have any question, don't hesitate before the exam to ask me. Have a wonderful day. Hello, 11th graders. This is Ms. Dana Atawi. Today, I'm going to make a quick revision for you for the final exam when it comes to the grammatical structure that are included uh, uh, for the final exam. You're going to be asked for the clip sentences, the general and infinitive uh, narrative tenses, and also finally the heel causative. Let's have a look at the clip sentences. Of course, this is uh, we have taken it. I explained it uh, when we were in uh, at school. Anyways, cliff sentences um, is to rewrite the sentences sentence where you focus on an information and you use the relative pronouns the heel, who, the when, the why, and so on and so forth. The most important sentence that you have to rely on the here, our teacher took us to the park yesterday. Suppose that I want you to focus on our teacher. Like this one here. The person. Because I'm talking about person who you continue took us to the park yesterday لأنه هنا verb to حتحط لي هنا was our teacher okay جدا الموضوع سهل طب if I want you to focus on the park so the park is a place so the place because it's place I'm going to use where the, the place where our teacher took us to Yesterday was the park. Le hatena hona was because we're talking about verb two. Tab is a direct kilan yesterday. Yesterday is a time. So the time when our teacher took us to the park was very good yesterday. There's also another way to rewrite the sentence where you begin with it. طيب إذا حكيت لك تعملها فوكس على our teacher so تحكي لي أنت it was mean our teacher لازم تستخدم relative pronoun it was our teacher who took us to the park yesterday طيب it was the park okay where our teacher took us yesterday طيب <coughs> it was yesterday when Yesterday, when the park were our teacher who, when our teacher took us to the park. This is the cliff sentence. So it's a matter of rewriting the sentence where you focus on a piece of information from the sentence and you use the relative pronoun uh, suitable for the information that you want to focus on. Time moving to the narrative tenses. Of course, the narrative tenses are the past tenses. Remember that the clip sentences you already we have taken it, so it's already written in your uh, copy books and you have the worksheet. Narrative tenses, we said that narrative tenses it means past tenses. I just want you to highlight, I just want to highlight on the most important uh, things that you need to know. We have here the past simple. Past simple means an action that happened and finished at a specific time. For example, we use the keywords li ago, yesterday, in uh, last. I do, I, also when. And when, remember that I always use with it verb to. The second one, li here, past continuous. Past continuous, li subject plus was or where plus verb ing. The most important word, li uh, word li while. And when, remember that I have it here with verb to. The banal explanation already موجود and can be on the e-learning. And the as. Also, if you want to use, for example, yesterday, but you need to add for it here a specific time at uh, 10 o'clock, <coughs> I was doing something. Okay? Done. Moving to the past perfect, past perfect, it means two actions, uh, one happened before the other one, or one action that uh, happened before a specific time in the past. The most important words are after and before. You need to know that after, I always have with it, he had the verb three, them and jumpa. Well, before, we could end the verb two, jumpa, we the verb three, we could end the verb two. Okay? And by also, by in the time of the past, I always use with it, he yeah, past perfect. 
فاينالي اللي هي الباست بيرفكت كونتينوس سبجكت بلس هاد بين بلس فيرب اي ان جي حكينا هون ذا موست امبورتنت ووردز اللي هي سينس اوف فور لايك ان ذا تايم اور ذا سيتويشن ان ذا سنتنس ات نيدز تو بي ان ذا باست سو بيسيكلي اي هاد بين ويتنج فور يو سينس 2 او كلوك وين ذا باست كيم ذس از فيرب Two. So we're talking about past. And now on a sense, ma to had kun indak past perfect continuous. Okay. Moving to the last uh, grammatical structure, which is the causative. Remember the causative. I always have subject plus have plus object plus li huwa past participle. And causative it means when you arrange for someone to do something for you. So basically, you're not the person who did the action. Rather, you ask someone or you arrange for someone else to do the, the action for you. And we have it uh, basically in our daily life. So basically, the mechanic fixes my car. My. I ask the mechanic to fix my car. I. I have to use have. And have relies on the tense of the sentence itself. Fixes here at present simple. I have. Okay, and the object my car, the past participle of fix, the he fixed. Type the painter painted our house. Manatuhona our we asked the painter to paint our house. We I look at the verb painted. This is verb two. We had not have. Leila and this is verb two. We had our house painted. طيب the man is collecting my money حكينا هنا my money طبعا أنا I asked the man to collect the money so I is collecting معناته I am having have here in the causative form relies uh, uh, on the tense of the sentence itself so I am having my money the past participle of collect اللي هي collected طيب she has cut my hair this means that I asked her to cut my hair has cut remember that this is present perfect so I has cut here has kun indak I have with the end of the third one I have had okay لما بتشوف انت present perfect او past perfect حتنزل اول واحدة منهم والتانية حتحطها had okay I have had my hair cut طيب he had sold the car for me he had sold the car for me which means that I asked him to sell the car for me so I حكيت لك نزل هاي نزل بعدها had Okay, the car sold. She wrote the email for me. Again, Hona, I wrote verb two. For the I had the email. The passport of uh, passport of wrote who really were written. This is the end of the revision. Remember that the gerund and infinitive you have taken exam uh, exam um, previously. The material is already with you. If you have any question, please don't hesitate. I have a wonderful uh, time and thank you for following with me.